Good morning, welcome to Tracy's Cakes in Longwick. Why don't we go in and have a look? So one of the first things you see when you come into my cake studio is this. Most people see this as they come through the door. It is an enormous pink flamingo cake structure. Um, it's actually a cake structure that I made a long time ago. Um, I actually took it on to the Alan Titchmarsh show on ITV a number of years ago. So it's not real. Um, it has got, it's got a polystyrene base, but everything on it has been made from chocolate um, and it does do the rounds every so often, but people love it and it's huge. So I always try and stand next to it to give you a bit of an idea just how enormous this cake is. Um, and also my castle cake here, bit of a Disney castle going on here without actually being Disney, but it's got all the Disney colours. Um, again, using that for weddings, normally comes out with me to wedding fairs, but obviously at the moment we aren't doing any wedding cakes. So this has taken pride of place next to the flamingo cake at this time. So another part of my business is I teach online cake painting. So I have lots of online courses and teach lots and lots of students all over the world how to paint things onto cakes. So here's a very small selection of some of the cakes that I have painted. Um, some of the ones I've been doing during lockdown recently have been live and that is the ones down the bottom there. If you can see the elephant and the dog and the panda, these are the ones that I've been teaching live with students. I also make a large number of cupcake bouquets and this is a very small selection of some of the ones that are on display down here at this time. So we do lots and lots of different ones. They are all on the website, so you are able to see them all on there. So here's one of our customer orders this morning. So this is a 12 cupcake bouquet, a pink and lilac one. And as you can see, it's pretty stunning. I also do lots of live online demonstrations down here at my cake studio in Longwick, um, including lots of videos on how to use different products, including this one, which I've done very recently. This is magic. So chocolate lollies that print bumblebees onto them. It's excellent, really good fun. And I'm gonna show you now how I pipe a couple of cupcakes, including one flower one, and then one you can do at home with the kids. So I'm just going to show you now how I would pipe a rose. So here is my cupcake and my piping nozzle. These are made out of buttercream. So all I do is swirl my cupcake round and then I start to pipe the petals. So just do them one at a time, like so. That's how we're going so far. It doesn't take long for them to build up. Just adding a layer at a time and we'll keep going. Buttercream is quite stiff because otherwise it would collapse. And then just keep going. Petals are getting a little bit bigger each time as we go round. The aim of the game is to go right to the edge of the cupcake and when the buttercream starts to move down the bag to stop and tighten it back up again. Nearly there. There we go. So I'm now going to show you how to make a fun cookie monster cupcake that you can do with the kids. So all you're going to need is a cupcake, a biscuit, some eyes. I've made some white sugar paste, a little bit of black sugar paste there and a piping bag with the grass nozzle in it like that. So that's what that looks like. It's got lots and lots of different holes in the bottom of it. So the first thing I've done is cut the cookie in half because the cookie is too big for the particular cupcake. So we've now got enough cookies there to do two. You can buy little mini cookies if you want to do that instead. But for this particular project, I've cut this in half. I'm going to pick up my cupcake and I'm going to start to pipe using my grass nozzles. All I'm going to do is hold this over my cupcake, squeeze and pull up. So touch the cupcake, squeeze, pull up like so. And I'm just going to go all over my cupcake like that. So we use this nozzle for grass. We use it for monsters. We can use it for hair. So it has lots and lots of different uses. The one thing you need to be doing with this particular nozzle is making sure that the buttercream remains soft at all times. Otherwise it can be quite difficult to pipe with. 
So I'll just keep going. So you're just going to go all over the cupcake. Just keep pulling it up like that. You can always go back and infill if you've missed anything. You can make it as long or as short as you want it to be. Go back there and put a little bit more in there. There we go. So the next thing I'm going to do is the eyes. So I'm just going to roll these balls of sugar paste that I've got earlier just into a little ball. And I'm going to put one on there and take the other one and pop that in there like that. Now Cookie Monster tends to look a bit, <sighs> a bit mad at times. So what we're going to do is put a little blob of water on there. So a tiny amount of water and put a little blob there as well. Got some black sugar paste. Again, just going to roll that between my fingers there and just pop that on like so. And then we'll put another eye over there. Like that. There he is. And then all you do is take your biscuit, pop that in, press it in, and there's your cupcake. So along with the Bumblebee Chocolate Lollipop Kit, which we have a brilliant video that you can watch on how to make them we're also now stocking homemade chocolate truffles and all you need to do with these kits is literally just add cream it's very straightforward all the instructions are there on the back and you can see all the chocolate and the ingredients in there so these are salted caramel ones and these ones are milk chocolate ones all you need to do is just go to the website and you can place an order on there so I hope you've enjoyed this little presentation here at my cake studio in Longwick. As I say, my name is Tracy Mann. You are very welcome to give me a call, ring me, email. I really don't mind if you have any questions in terms of cake decorating, whether you want to order a cake, whether you want to order a cupcake bouquet, whether you want to learn, whether you want to watch a demonstration, please do get in contact. My website address is www.tracescakes.co.uk. Trace has got an E in it. Um, I'm also on Instagram at Tracy Man Cakes. Man is M A N N. And also on Facebook with the same address at Tracy Man Cakes. Say, so I would be lovely to see some of you again, and thank you very much for watching this presentation, and I'll see you all again soon.